welcome back. The Wiregrass Habitat for Humanity held a special press conference today to share some exciting news during a difficult year. Ellie O'Connor has the story. Wiregrass Habitat for Humanity is always lending a hand to the community, like here in their ReStore, where you can drop off your old items and they will be refurbished and resold with every profit going towards the Habitat's cause. And with October being Homeless Connect Month, they couldn't not help out our community. Today's press conference was an announcement that the Habitat for Humanity is donating a little under three acres of land to SEACH, or the Southeast Alabama Coalition for Homelessness. To be involved and to be able to contribute um, to a population that, uh, that is a little different than our, our standard population we're reaching out to is a true blessing. Um, and there's no better, better people to partner with than uh, Cody at the Harbor and Ken over at 211. The Harbor and other ministries in Dothan have always had open connections to the homeless population, but now, with October being deemed Homeless Connect Month, it has brought more attention to the homeless community and how the city can help. To be able to put people together um, that share the same goals, the same values, with the ultimate goal of transitioning out of homelessness, to put people in there on the same property and for seats to have that property and be able to see it, it is, is absolutely wonderful. The Harbor and the other ministries are looking forward to continuing their work with Wiregrass Habitat for Humanity, but realize there's still a ways to go. Um, so it's exciting, but I'm also the type of person that says, okay, it's one more step, what's the next one? Let's go do it. Seach is very excited to start construction on their new land in November. And remember, if you have any stuff that needs to get donated, you can always drop it off here at the ReStore. Covering local news first in Dothan, I'm Allie O'Connor, WDHN News.